I am not shooting steel, and I don't recommend shooting steel until it's probably much later in the series, because the downside to shooting steel is you don't know where you're hitting. Now, you might say, well, we'll shoot a small steel, so I, if I hit it, it's good, right? You know, same size as one of those circles. Well, the problem with that is when you miss, do you know where you miss? Most people aren't skilled enough to call exactly that was off to the left two or three inches, or that was off to the left like a foot because I just muscled the gun and pulled it way down as I pulled the shot. So I don't use steel for training besides shooting targets at much further distances where you know I can see splash behind the target. I'm good at calling my shot. I'm not gonna walk all the way down 400 meters to paste paper, although that is a good thing to do every once in a while. So I highly recommend not shooting steel for a while. Steel is like dessert, gives you some like instant gratification and you feel really good. Spoiler alert, most people shooting steel up close are not actually that good at shooting, uh, especially early on in their shooting journey or career. Uh, we wanna be shooting paper.